An important decision today about medical marijuana. A court in British Columbia ruled users can continue growing their own pot for now. This decision comes less than two weeks before new laws for medical pot take effect in Canada. And that had some patients worried. Kirk Williams explains. For a $5 donation, anyone is welcome to smoke pot at the headquarters of the B.C. Marijuana Party. The saying here, break a law to change a law. So it makes sense that people are lighting up to celebrate a legal victory today. You know, this is huge news. You know, and so many patients right now, they're not suffering tonight. Tonight they're going to get to sleep. A federal judge has approved an injunction allowing current licensed medical marijuana users to continue growing their own pot past April 1st. That's when new regulations kick in that would have forced them to destroy their plants and buy marijuana from new, commercially licensed producers. The move affects almost 40,000 Canadians who use marijuana to reduce pain or treat a variety of conditions. Many argued it was cheaper to grow their own specialized strains than be forced to buy more expensive, regulated marijuana. A lawyer for four patients successfully argued the new rules would create hardship, thus violating their charter rights. Using a specific strain. New companies like Medijan will now have to compete with current growers and rely on new patients or those willing to make the switch. The market range for, for patients that require this medicine sits anywhere from between 400,000 people to upwards of almost 2 million. So it's a big enough market to find a place for everybody in it. Health Canada is studying the decision but insists the new rules will cut down on growers who sell surplus marijuana illegally, eliminate fire hazards from grow ops and reduce crime. Just this week, one person was injured after shots were fired in Langley at a licensed grow-up. The injunction is temporary until a full trial on the issue later this year. If there's any merit to any of the government claims about mold and fire and all this stuff, that all of those things are remedial and can be dealt with in, by less intrusive uh, ways, than taking away the right of personal production. So for now, rather than drink to their health, medical marijuana patients are smoking to it and gathering support to fight the next legal battle. Kirk Williams, CBC News, Vancouver.